3D printing on mesh fabrics. Print a layer and then you put in the mesh and continue printing and then you basically have the dragon scales. So the trick is you don't want the mesh to be too thick. The layer below it and above it, they don't adhere to each other. Use a mesh that has no stretch in it. Researchers that take a stretchy fabric on purpose. It takes all of the shapes and that's what they call 4D printing. This is Iris van Herpen. She is a Dutch fashion designer and these are the same technique but with a different printer, like a more high-end printer. Sophie Wong is a super cool creator who also works with this technique and uh, she made this really amazing dress and she has a really cool light-up jacket. Right now, if you ask me, the person that does this the best is Kaizen 3D Prints. Things that he does with it are so amazing. So he has this clutch and a gift box. I really like this one and I think he's mo mostly known about this one. He has a free set of models for people who just want to begin. So this is his five patterns for fabric. And then let's let them into the slicer and see if we can give it a go. Okay. I decided we're gonna do the pointy hexagons first. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a modify G codes. We're gonna add a pause and layer height. And we're gonna add pause at layer height one. I'm gonna start the print job. <laughs> 